What's up guys, it is your boy back um because of my paintball videos all my videos are in first person because of the GoPro on the helmet, right? They put the stand and everything so you don't get to actually see any of my gear. So I thought I'd make a quick little video for those of you who are interested in my gear. Now my gear is I've accumulated it's not I bought everything overnight, I know I accumulated accumulated all this over a period of time, you know. It's not the stock barrel, uh it's not the stock parts. Barrels longer, uh, this TIPX is now first strike compatible. I can run a remote line to my TPX. I can run the tank on my back along with the remote line, which is right here. And I have my little holster right here on top of my CO2 cartridges. So I have three seven round for my small pouches. I have three seven round mags. They only hold up to seven, you know, seven rounds. Right. Nothing, just a stock mag. It came with the gun. Seven rounds, you get to reload. And I have one mag on my holster, which is good because what I use it for is my. Because it can hold a big mag. So I have the 20 round Zayu mag. You, two, you shoot 10 shots, you flip the mag over, and you shoot another 10 shots. And then you have to reload. And those Zeta mags are first strike compatible. And then I have one 12 round mag, right? First strike compatible as well. First strike is what lets me outgun the hopper fed players because they have 200 rounds in their mag and me, I have, you know, a couple, the biggest magazine is a 12 round magazine right here, which is first strike compatible. So I can be more accurate than them. I can outgun them in most situations. And if it's indoors or it's nighttime, I have a flashlight with strobe, which really helps out a lot. On top of the extended barrel, which means I can pick targets off at farther distance than most people can with round ball. 